Good morning. Today we are having pancakes. I'm doing, I've never done this before, and I'm eyeballing the ingredients, which I probably shouldn't do. So in here I've got one banana, one cup of oats. I'm only doing cups because it seems to be, well firstly I have cups. I've never used these before. And secondly, yeah, a lot of recipes seem to be in cups because of Americans. Anyway, so I've got a splash of cinnamon, cup of oats, cup of soya, banana. I'm going to blitz this and see how it comes out because I think it might be too thick. I think I might need a bit more liquid. You know what, let's just add a bit in more liquid. Cheeky. Yeah, let's do it. Well, that's not very round, is it? Should I try and do them over the whole s size? Well, that was a massive fail, wasn't it? I don't know what happened. I don't know if it's just because I got my measurements completely off, whether my pan's crap, whether the pan was too hot. If you have any uh, pancake or like these three recipe, three ingredient recipe pancakes, vegan recipe, vegan pancake recipes, if you have any, let me know. I mean, they taste amazing, <laughs> but they look horrific. <laughs> I consider that to be a semi fat, a semi win because they're a bit crunchy. Mmm, yum. So, a bubble friend got me a chair. <laughs> and look what it does. Wait. I've broken it already. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that went back too fast. <laughs> yeah, so let's put that back. Okay. We're good. <laughs> it's so comfy. It's got these massive arms on it. And yeah, it beats that because that was so uncomfortable. Another day, another package. So, Bubble Friend got this for Christmas from her best friend. I don't feel like it's correct. Oh, this is not correct. This should be a two piece. That's a one piece. Hmm. Obviously, with a bra. Hmm. Okay, I need to complain. I did see the package and I was like, this doesn't seem big enough for two items. Nope, I need to go out, just to let you know. This is my lunch, uh, mushrooms with avocado and feta cheese on toast. Yum. Fresh, out of the microwave. So I just went onto Nasty Girl's website 
to complain about not receiving the joggers. It's so funny with these companies because I had something similar with Boohoo a couple of years ago. She was like, "Okay, sorry for the sorry for the mis mis mistake, whatever." Um, because you only received half of the item, I can give you back half of the refund. And I was like, no, <laughs> I want the whole refund. Straight away, she was like, okay. I was like, please, can you send me out the new ones? She was like, oh no, we don't have them in stock. So I got a free chart, basically. This popcorn is sweet popcorn. I don't normally like sweet. I'm normally salty. Mm hmm my old road that's the house I used to live in can you see it there that was my studio you can't really see it there anyway um we're outside yeah this road has been um oh, traffic warden this road has been resurfaced very fancy, very smooth, lovely. I'm going over to Way to Save, which is um, an amazing supermarket. I've actually never been there. It's over in Harlesden. Because <clears throat> I want to try and find my kelp powder. Kelp powder is basically seaweed, obviously kelp. Um, but it's good for putting in things so that they taste fishy which sounds not the best <laughs> it's a good uh, little vegan trick right where am I going to park why is it raining I'm taking a oh, yeah I could park there oh this is good this is good perfect space Pole position, as my dad would say. <laughs> Bang. After looking down so many aisles, I finally found this one. This is the black salt I wanted. Mmm, this is exciting. Mm. <sighs> it's now pitch black outside. <laughs> that shop was like a time warp. You know what? It was like, you know when you go on holiday, I know, can, we, can any of us remember? It's like you're going on holiday and you're going to a supermarket and you have no idea what anything is. That's basically how I felt. Like obviously it had some like regular Tesco, whatever it is, brands. What are they carrying? Oh, pizza. Um, yeah, obviously there are some regular brands, but generally, no. I ended up getting so many amazing bits. I got, oh, I ended up getting tahini sauerkraut like who do I think I am but it was really great for um and I'm so glad I got my black salt have it oh I can have a little tofu scramble in the morning oh, it's all exciting this is one thing I'm really oh that smells good I can smell the basil and I got one of the um like seeded seeded loaves but like the sesame fresh loaves um oh god I'm aching yeah it literally was like going on holiday that shop I spoke to Maggie about it and she was like yeah you'll definitely find your seasoning there because it's like an Aladdin's cave which is exactly right I'm so glad I got one of the two I must have looked at least they've got at least 500 spices there and like spices and herbs there we go <clears throat> and I didn't even find it in that section I found it in the organic section which was bizarre but yes 
it's all very exciting what's this oh yeah garlic so yeah because my garlic's gone moldy now i need to go collect my prescription then we're gonna go home i feel knackered so i'm making sushi <laughs> ignore all the disgusting water that came up um i've got my rice i think it's overcooked but that's the best we've got so i'm going to add in this is some tofu and some mushrooms here got these bits here got my rolling mat i mean i could be doing better with space but hey I'm watching Grey's Anatomy and Denny Duquette has just uh, arrived. My Id ideal man. Why did I cut these pieces so big? Mm. I'd give it a good 7 out of 10. Needs wasabi. Missing the fish. And it just needs a bit more crunch to it. But pretty damn good. Oh wow, it's really raining. Sometimes now, I don't know if it's raining or if it's just my soundtrack, but that is, that's rain. It's because I've got my window open. Let's do a haul. Extra virgin olive oil. I can't even remember what I bought. It feels like that long ago. Meds that I picked up from the pharmacy afterwards. These are my new ones. 50 milligrams, sertraline. Did I tell you I spoke to the doctor yesterday? And I told him my issues with propranolol and he recommended that I take sertraline alongside it to kind of like boost me up a bit. So that is what we're going to do from tomorrow, which is great news. See how I go for, try it for like four weeks. I'll see how I go. Basil. A good, good chunk of basil from Kenya. Wow. Kenya to Harlesden. Poor basil. I don't even remember why I bought it. I remember thinking, oh, I need basil for something. Can I remember? Hmm. Uh, pimiento. Pimiento stuffed olives. 89p. Very good value. All this shopping was £14, which I thought was really good, bearing in mind... Uh, I got some organic things. I got some organic sauerkraut with infused with juniper berries. I don't know if it's normally. Uh, I think that's fancy. I don't know. But I, when I have, when I used to have the um, New Yorker sandwich, the sauerkraut was like one of my favourite things. So, yeah. More tablets. Finally got some tahini. I've been, I've been wanting this for ages. Oh good, it's sealed. Um, I don't really like it, but a lot of recipes I see have it in it. So tahini is basically just sesame paste. And it's quite strong. Two lemons. I can't remember why I bought lemons. Oh no, I did see a, I did see a recipe with lemons in it. My memory is terrible. Or just you know why not garlic bananas black peppercorns curry powder mild because I didn't want to take any um, any risks with the, the hot one. Oh yeah and this was my um, Kala Namak which is black salt black rock salt has a faintly sulfurous and smoky flavor which disappears during the cooking process What's the point then? It, it's meant to take. It's meant to make things taste eggy. In a loaf. Oh, that smells so good. 
Um, I don't need all this bread. I'll give some to Maggie. Oh, I can't. She's um, she can't eat sesame. I'm literally just shoving it back in the bag. I'll put the Kenyan basil away. I remembered what I wanted the uh, basil for, like a basil and tomato salad, like a caprese salad, maybe with some feta. Maybe like a combo Greek salad tomorrow with a bit of olive in it. Mm. Mmm, that smells so good. It smells like cake. It's so loud it is when I have my window open. <laughs> Where I've been wearing that ring, I've cut my hand, which seems so ridiculous and small, but it really freaking hurts. <laughs> I keep doing, ooh, and I keep like moving my hand around. I'm like, ah. <laughs> Honestly. Can be such a wimp sometimes. Friday, AM. City's gonna break your heart. First day on the search for lean. Oh good, they're a different shape. This, I don't know how I lived without this pill box, you know. <laughs> it's a faff to put them all in, but then it's so easy. Look at these roots. Oh freaking red. Oh, I say already. It was done at the beginning of December, so it's not really already. I'm just complaining. This one is an under the eye caffeine solution, 5%. Reduces appearance of eye contour pigmentation and puffiness. I got these original products, even though I do like them. I got them on um, Olio, obviously. I don't think I need this stuff. I just use it because I have it, basically. City's gonna break your heart. Down the hatch. <clears throat> I need, need, need to drink more water today. I need to put my old chair on Olio. I need to tidy up because this is bad. And I just got a comment on last night's video being like, your studio is so cluttered. It's giving me anxiety. Your type of studio that's so small suits a minimalist feel. There's stuff everywhere. And I was like, I know. This person is obviously not a regular. Firstly, I blocked them. Secondly, <laughs> petty. Secondly, this person is obviously not a regular viewer because I complain about the clutter every video. So, and they are correct. So, yeah. But blocked nonetheless. Google. Play. I thought I'd wear my new jumper. I quite like it actually. With a bra on, it looks better. Obviously it's just meant to be loungewear and you can pull these ties, oh, you can like pull these ties at the back. So it's more <laughs> penis pouch. Um, yeah, so it's more tight in, but I like it. It's good for just being around the house. Should we play Guess the Weather? I've kind of seen it, but I've kind of not. I can hear, I can hear that it's wet. I'm guessing cloud and, cloud and rain, but it could be bright. That's basically cheating, but that's what I'm guessing. Let's guess the weather, let's guess the, ooh. Every day, get stuck. Let's guess the weather, let's guess the weather. Ooh, no, it's, it's sunnier than expected. It's quite bright. Feels like it's got potential there. It's so hot in this house. Okay, I need to say goodbye to this little chair today. Needs to go. Let's take a picture of it. Pop it on Olio. Don't mind me, just <laughs> cradling a loaf. Um, this smell of this bread reminds me of my mum's house. <clears throat> oh. The aftermath of sushi. Oh, I've got the leftover sushi. I need to, I'm looking forward to doing it again and righting the wrongs. 
I did last yeah that I did last time and sorting out I know I say it every time and I'm a broken record but I nearly had so many accidents last night with this freaking cupboard what I want is like um some storage some storage jars to like because I've got one for rice I've got one for pasta sorry I've got one for porridge I've got one for pasta I want one for rice maybe one for cereal maybe just to like keep it more oh I need some more mayonnaise what am I gonna have banana on toast banana on toast So good. So I'm making this and it comes out like this. <laughs> so mm. leftovers. Mm. I like the noodles. I shouldn't be eating this with my new top on. <laughs> I've got my Greek salad tonight and I'm rest I'm resting it here. That is just not a good idea, is it? Yeah, I've got um Greek salad with uh feta, olives, basil, spinach, cucumber tomato, a bit of toast. Hello. It's Saturday morning. Well, just it's quarter past eleven. I wanted to wake up early, but I'm having problems with my um, Google Nest with it connecting to the internet. I've had it in internet problems for like weeks now. It's just too boring to even tell you. Basically, I've got an extender, and the extender was stopping me connecting to the normal network, but either yet that was connected to the extender, and now I've unplugged the Basically, I don't think that that is close enough to the actual router, which is really annoying because the girl next door has got one. I've got a coffee. I'm going to sit here in bed for a bit. I'm going to do a bit of reading because Charlie inspired me. Oh, that's a good one. <coughs> oh. Ooh, it's got the syrup in there. It's good. And then for breakfast, we have a banana, which is just lounging on the pillow. Love a lounging banana and a sandwich and a toasted cheese and coleslaw, smoked cheese and coleslaw sandwich because why not? So I got a comment about the food I eat. It says, Lauren, it's, it's a lovely comment, don't get me wrong. Um, you make me laugh out loud. Lauren, you are so real. It is amazing. Your food choices continue to baffle, in capitals, me. At the stage, I think... Um, at this stage, I think I enjoy being repulsed by what you consider acceptable in the same bowl. It entertains me, it, it entertains me no end. <laughs> well, Carrie, I wonder what you think of this lovely sandwich here. Because I'm going to scoff it and love it. <laughs> it's now 20 to 5. And it's still, still light outside-ish. We're getting some brightness back in our evening. So I've got a runny nose. Um... I have just made pasta, I haven't had pasta in ages, with cheese, fresh tomato, and basil, and a bit of olive oil, and I'm watching Grey's Anatomy, and it's great.
my oh, oh, I'm wearing my new jumper and I'm feeling it let me see if I can show you it's cute little ties tied at the side yeah now I need to go because I'm late <laughs> oh the dip's vegan yeah. um so it's Saturday night I haven't spoken to you all day Oh no, you just saw me put my makeup on actually. I've just been watching Grey's Anatomy all day and I've wanted to try the Domino's vegan pizza for so long. Sorry. Thank you. <clears throat> Are you excited? Thank you for getting it. It's alright. And buying it. <laughs> <laughs> vegan friendly. I haven't got any fake meat on here today. Oh, it's not in workers. I haven't got any fake meat on here today. Have you got any fake meat on there? Just real meat. Just real meat. Ooh. Ooh. Yum, yum, yum. My tum, tum, tum. Do you want a bit? No, thank you. So this is the vegan uh, Veggie Supreme. And they only do this size, which is upsetting. But no, I'm glad I got this size because I didn't eat any bigger. So, my battery died. It's amazing. Mmm. The only more difference is the texture of the cheese. It's a bit more gluey than normal cheese. Let's try the dip. Mmm. I've had Domino's in about 10 years. Have you? <laughs> We've come to Costa drive through. Well, they've got caramel oat, vanilla, coconut, Thanks. hazelnut, almond. Mm. Why are they telling you it's got added zinc in it? No one wants to know that. Um, it's loud, isn't it? What a great angle. <laughs> Pardon? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna zoom it right in. Oh, good. So, which one do you want? Vanilla coconut. Lotto plus. Decaf, please. Mm, spot on. Oh. She was just like, they do an egg, spinach, and what was it? Egg and spinach bap. Egg and spinach bap. Egg, spinach. Oh, mushroom. Egg, spinach, mushroom bap. And I was like, yeah, it's not vegan, is it? Mm. Ask her what vegan toasters they have, please. Morning. Oh, hello. Um, do you have any vegan toasties? We do. We have vegan ham and cheese, and we have this vegan barbecue chicken, and they're both so lovely. Are you guys vegan? One person is. Sorry? What, uh, only one. One of us. Oh, is. okay. I'm vegan too, and I think they're really great, and you should try them. Oh, I'll have the ham and, uh, ham and cheese, please. Ham and cheese. Oh, my God, yeah. Um, toast, toasty with a vanilla coconut latte plus, but decaf. Oh, I'm so sorry, but like yesterday was really busy. We actually sold out of all of our coconut and oat milk. So no. We only have soy and almond right now. Uh, Which one's uh, uh, so, uh, But you know what? The soya. almond, the almond one's really good. Oh, the, but the only thing is with plus drinks, if we make them decaf, it degrades the vitamins and protein that we have in it. Okay, so can you just have an, an almond, a vanilla almond latte? Sure thing. What de size de decaf, yeah. What size? Um, yeah, what size medium, like please. It? Medium, please. Medium, decaf, almond, vanilla, sure thing, and then there's toasty. Anything else for you guys? Yeah. Can I get a um, like a bacon bat? Uh, yeah, sure thing. Yeah. And can I get a uh, flat white, please? Me oh, of course. A flat medium. white and a bacon. See, this is Custom England. Service. This is England down to a T. What did you just say? Nothing. She's too enthusiastic. 
No, it's lovely. She was lovely. If you were vegan, you'd want to meet fellow vegans. Yes, I'm, I'm like an eat animal. She's very loud. <laughs> she was loud though. You such a said. bit. I had my windows closed and we could hear her. She was she, lovely. She, well, it's Great the opposite of you. No one can ever hear you. <laughs> it's funny when I edit, I can see like the wave sound lines and the ones for you are like this big and the ones for me are like this big when we're sat next well, to each I'm other. I'm sorry I'm very softly spoken. Pardon? I'm not sorry actually, it's just my dulcet tones. <laughs> so here it is. The famous toasty. I mean, it doesn't really taste of anything. Do you want ketchup? Mm. You got any ketchup in the car? No. Mm. I do. Look at the fake meat. That is horrible. Mm. Are there two B&Qs? That's like a warehouse. Mm. Yeah, it's nice. Kind of hits the spot. How's your bap? Warm. How is it today? Pretty good. Dun, dun. Lots of olives and what's that? Tomato? Onion, mushrooms, tomato, peppers, and vegan cheese. Hello, hello. How cute does that mirror look behind? The answer? So cute. Uh, I feel like I've barely spoken to you at all this week. Um, my anxiety has made my brain feel like a hurricane. Like constantly body scanning to see if there's something wrong with me um constantly worrying there is something wrong with me my body actually feeling things like sore throats that are that go away so it's not even real uh constant so i need some hydra hello i need some hydration firstly <clears throat> and I've just been having a tinker on my keyboard. I did do a bit of tidying up just now. I put away some clothes, put away all my washing. I did another load of washing at Bubble Friends last night, which was great. So I've got um, clean towels for the first time in longer than I'd like to admit. I just sold my phone. I just sold my old phone on eBay for 270 quid, eh? amazing and um yeah i just thought i'd give you a bit of a i'm nowhere this is the first time playing since last week and i feel like i'm getting slightly emphasis on slightly better so we're gonna do my heart will go on again by celine dion obviously uh yeah let's have a plonk
Why is there a bike as soon as I try and film? And we are live on Instagram. See? <laughs> Inception. Come on, you can do it. That was so fun, as always. Um, and I've just sat on my phone for like half an hour, which I shouldn't have done. And now it's what? It's half nine. <sighs> I'm shattered. I'm loving this lip colour. I just put on a tiny bit. It is the Urban Decay Lip Lip Mousse in the colour Frequency. Now, it looks like this. And then you, you pop it like that. And that's the colour. And this here comes out in this little applicator. I did use it, but then I ended up just using my finger instead. But yeah, as you can see, it's very red. And I only wanted like a lip stainy kind of colour. So that's what we went with tonight. Hello, hello, editing Lauren here. Much gl less glamorous version than the Lauren you've just seen. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Thank you for getting to this point and listening to the whole of My Heart Will Go On by Celine Dion. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyway, love you all. Thank you for watching. Um, my link for my coffee, if you want to support my channel, is down below as always. Love you all. See you next week. Mm, bye.